John Bennett with Logic Pro X and in this video we're going to talk about bars and beats and counting music and it's a very basic video but a lot of you guys are getting into playing around with Logic and remixing and whatnot and I've had some questions about what was I talking about ones and fives well when you look at Logic here the main area formerly known as the arrange area is split up in these vertical lines these vertical lines represent beats and bars. The numbers are bar numbers. So in music you would count one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. A lot of music I count, I count it to eight. So I'd go one, two, three, four. This would be a five. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, one, five, and so on. So that's how you arrange these things. Up in the top, you have the, the BPM, the beats per minute for the entire project. And beats per minute is the measure of how, how the tempo of your project. You can have a dynamic beat per minute. You can change the tempo throughout the project. Most songs stick with it with the same tempo for the whole time. But oftentimes max up max mashups and remixes will have tempo changes. And I showed you in an in a other video how to do that and have a nice tempo curve. So just for the sake of showing you how this works, I've drug in the, a very, very basic example of what you can do with a mashup or a remix. So I got the studio acapella for I Love It, and I've got the instrumental for Live for the Night, which is by Cruella. And it's I Love It by Icona Pop or Icona Pop, I'm not sure how you say it. So let's just take a listen. I've brought these in, I've matched them to my tempo here, and now I've lined them up with the downbeat or the one beat being on an odd number. I usually start my projects on three. That's just how I do it. So here you go. Okay, so that's the instrumental. Then I got the acapella from a completely different song here. I got this feeling on the summer day when you were gone. I crashed my car into the bridge, I watched, I let it burn. I threw your shit into a bag and pushed it down the stairs. I crashed my car into the bridge, I don't care. So, I'm going to play around with this and show you just a very, very basic example of, a, of the beginnings of what be, could be a pretty cool remix. Hey, I'm back. It took about five or 10 minutes just to mess around and chop it up a little bit, just so you get an idea of what's possible. And again, this is a very, very basic example using only one acapella and one instrumental from a completely different song. Just give me a feel for what it sounds like. So you get the idea. That's an introduction to bars, beats, and basic mashup and remix. See you in the next video.